Brian with Sunflower Outdoor Sports here. Just doing a quick video on how to install the Harris bipod adapter on your Ruger Mini 14 or 30. This is my second attempt at this video. I did it once and the rifle I was using had a sling attachment here that was bent and misshapen. So when I put it on, the Harris didn't set quite right. So I'm redoing the video. So on my first video the two prongs for the small fork weren't locking into those grooves on the big fork so you look here you want to have the small fork at an angle as you slide so that you slide through your sling mount there and then you want to lift up small fork to where it's at a 90 degree angle and you can drop it down into the slots. So then your sling mount can rest against there and you can tighten up your set screw. Um, I think it's easier if you do it with your gun vertical because then you aren't trying to hold the sling mount Then you gonna back it off. Pop it back off, it comes off. So like I said, you want, with your gun in this position, it should slip right in. The fork should drop right in. Like I said, on the other video, it was late in the evening. And I wasn't paying as much attention. Which is why you shouldn't do videos late in the evening. Um, but there it is on and off. Pretty simple. But if you don't have it in the right position it can be a pain and you can get frustrated and say how does this thing work? Now if you look in the instructions that Harris sends with their bipods uh, they probably have a paragraph of written descriptions and one small little picture. So if you're just going off the manufacturer's instructions, it can be it can be a little diff difficult to get mounted. 